so I have been a new YouTuber for one month. 53 subscribers, 25 videos. Things I've learned since my last video. So I've learned YouTube is a lot of work. It's like fun, but it is a lot of work. Like especially when you schedule yourself, which is it's it's sort of good because your subscribers want to know when your videos are coming out. I've realized this past two weeks that I have not been able to upload my schedule videos like I said I would. Oh! I'm sorry guys. And life happened, you know. So I recommend if you're a new YouTuber that you should try to stay consistent with your videos. Um, but I also, along with consistency, being a new YouTuber, you're still trying to figure out like what videos you want to post, like what kind of content you want to have. So just voice that. Let them know that you're figuring it out and bear with you. Um, I hope my subscribers don't fall off because I haven't been as active as I wanted to be. And I promise I wanted to be active because if I didn't, I wouldn't be videoing everything I'm doing. But I just haven't had time to post because I've been too tired from driving or whatever. So just know that I'm trying to stay consistent and I'm still trying to figure things out. So stay tuned for more. So the next thing I've learned is that um, I have to plan my videos, planning time to edit videos, not even post them, just edit them and then just schedule them to be posted. Give me a day because editing takes a while. Like give me a day that I'm just going to put together my video, at least two videos that day. And then I'll post them later on the next week or later on that week. It depends how my schedule is going to be. But editing takes some time. <laughs> Especially when you're new. Um, I don't know if it gets easier when you get older or <laughs> older and become an older YouTuber, but I hope so. So when it comes to editing, I found that the two best apps I've used so far are iMovie and uh, oh, Pocket Video. Those are great. Um, they're free. They're easy to use, and I am still figuring out. I'm. I have. I have, uh, what's that? oh, Pick Monkey, but I haven't used it a lot. I heard, I got some reviews on it, um, but maybe I'll venture out and let you guys know how that goes. But yeah, so look into those. So like I said, I've been a YouTuber for a month, and there's still a lot I don't know about video editing. There's so many things I want to learn, like um, how to add the little, like little information thing on there. I know it shouldn't be that hard, but I still haven't figured it out. I just haven't had time to like research stuff, more stuff that I want to learn. So schedule, like I said, schedule a day where you just like YouTube or um, research stuff that you want to put in your videos, uh, how you do this, how you do that. Uh, what else did I want to learn? Uh, I want to learn how to do better thumbnails. Um, I want to learn how to do better just editing in general, just, just stuff that I want to learn. So just, I plan to do some research. So hopefully you guys can see how that that research. And then the other thing is that my subs. I think I got like 50 subs in the first two weeks or 40, something like that. I got like a lot of subs in the first two weeks, but they have been like steady, like steady as the days have gone by. I don't know. It might be because I haven't been as active like, um, posting my videos or, or getting my videos out there but they have declined and it's cool because I'm not as active it's fine you're not as active either so hopefully I can get back in it and get more subscribers and it'll be great so I think that's it for now if you guys have any questions please comment below um, you can also Facebook me Instagram me uh, what's the other one Twitter me or snapchat me so all those links will be posted below. Um, and like this video, please. And subscribe if you haven't already. Okay, thank you for watching. God bless.